All right, you guys, so I dropped off that last order. Everything went A-OK. -okay. DoorDash shows up once again. Rubio's, $9.25 for 2.9 miles. And the drop off is right by the house. All right, you guys, so I just left the house. I was at the house way too long. I was there maybe an hour and a half, two hours. Anyways, we're back to making this money. DoorDash double order. So we'll get the chilies order. Keep that nice, nice, nice and warm inside the grub pub back and then we're gonna pick up uh the jamba juice order because you know it's drinks and we have grub pub going off there's just so much going on right now let's see what grub pub's talking about eight dollars 70 cent cold stone now we're gonna decline that all right you guys i just made it to the marriott to drop off the second um order delivering to the hotel and we had to deliver the food to the actual pool it was two pools i just showed you guys the outside pool <laughs> the freaking doordash app decides to not work tonight so look like we won't be using this for the dinner rush we try nothing happened what up world it's your boy Zilla. Thanks for joining your boy Zilla on this ride along ride with Zilla. Do 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 do. Riding with Zilla. Do 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 do. As you know, on this channel we do all apps Grubhub, Postmates, Uber Eats, Amazon Flex, Instacart, and even that thing they call DoorDash. Our goal is $100 for the day, maybe even two. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Let's go get this paper. All right, you guys, first order of the day, Uber Eats, 14 minutes total, 2.8 miles to $7.48. I'm here, drop off, I think we'll take this one. Let's get it. All right, you guys, I went inside, of course, everything was ready, good old Uber Eats, the food, it's always ready, however, no bags, Uber Eats, everything nice and tight inside the Grubhub bag. There's also one drink. This is a no contact delivery. The customer said, please do not ring the doorbell, just leave it and make sure I text her and let her know her food is there. Customer is 2.2 miles away. Let's go drop off these goodies. All right, you guys, so I dropped off that Uber Eats order. Everything went A-OK, -okay. and guess what? DoorDash decides to join the party. We have a double order. DoorDash, I believe $14 for grand total, of maybe five miles. Have they had the Panda Express, in a place called L and L Hawaiian Barbecue. If you guys remember, last time they messed up my order at L and L Hawaiian Barbecue, so I'm gonna make sure they have all the items. All right, you guys, so I just picked up both orders. Order number one, nice and tight inside the Grubhub bag. There's also a drink. Order number two down there in the Postmates bag. First customer is only one mile away. This is apartment complex. However, he said make sure I call and text him. He'll meet me outside. That's what I'm talking about, okay? Anytime we have to deliver it to apartment complex, it's always nice when the customer meets us outside. Let's go drop off these goodies. All right, you guys, so I dropped off those two orders. Everything went A-OK. -okay. We have another DoorDash. It's only $6.75. However, it's heading back for its home base. And it's only, I believe, 1.2 miles. $6.75. 1.2 miles. All right, you guys, I went inside. Everything was ready. Everything nice and tight inside the Grubhub bag. Even though Mickey D's pack up their bags, oh so lovely. Customers 0.4 miles away. This is a no contact. Please leave it at the front door delivery. All right, you guys, so I dropped off that uh, DoorDash order to Mickey D's. Everything went A-OK. -okay. Now, as you can see, once again, pick up six. Three items, 3.1 miles for $9.75. I'm right here by the restaurant. Drop off, you know, we'll take this quick, $9.75. So, these are the three items we're picking up from my dude Ryan at Pickup Six. And my screen is super dirty. All right, you guys, so I went inside. Everything was ready on time. It was like 10 minutes early. That's what your boy talking about. Anyways, my dude Ryan is 2.7 miles away. This is a pre-COVID handed to me delivery all right you guys so i dropped off that last order everything went a-okay -okay. doordash shows up once again rubio's nine dollars 25 cents for 2.9 miles and the drop off is right by the house all 
All right, you guys, went inside. Everything was ready. Everything nice and tight inside the Grubhub bag. There's also a uh, drink. Like I was saying, my dude Mason, he stays right by the house. As soon as I drop this off to my dude Mason, I'm gonna stop by the house, grab some chips, some water, something to snack on real quick, and then we will continue getting this paper. All right, you guys, so I just left the house. I was at the house way too long. I was there maybe an hour and a half, two hours. Anyways, we're back to making this money. DoorDash double order. Three items, 4.1 miles, Jamba Juice and Chili's, and I'm right here by both restaurants. Both drop offs should be easy. 18 bucks after that long two hour break. All right, you guys, so I just made the chilies first. I'm gonna pick up the chilies order since you know Jamba Juice is gonna be drinks. So we'll get the chilies order, keep that nice, nice, nice and warm inside the grub back, and then we're gonna pick up uh, the Jamba Juice order because you know it's drinks, and we have grub pub going off. There's just so much going on right now. Let's see what grub I'm talking about. $8.70 cold stone. Now we're gonna decline that. Hopefully, 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 everything goes smoothly. So, this is the order we're picking up from Jamba Juice. And the order, the customer texts me, thank you. And orders from Chili's. Um, I don't know what it is. Most likely, she placed it online through the Chili's website versus the DoorDash app, but we'll find out. All right, you guys, so I just made the Jamba Juice and I just picked up the first order from Chili's. I have to use a large grab her back. There's also a drink, so I'm about to pick up this order, and they're gonna drop off these two orders for $18, and I believe, what was it, 84 cents? All right, you guys, so I went inside, I got the drinks. Everything's right there, right there, bare naked. Anyway, so the good news is Jennifer, so she's the first drop off, and she's only 1.2 miles away, so hopefully we get it to her within three to two minutes. All right, you guys, so I just made it to the Marriott to drop off the second um, order. And this is her instruction. She said, bring it to the poo. If we can focus. You trying to go to the poo, girl? All right, you guys. So that was an absolute first. Delivering to the hotel. And we had to deliver the food to the actual pool. It was two pools. I just showed you guys the outside pool. She was actually located inside the inside pool. Outdoor pool, indoor pool, all of the above. Anyway, so let's see what's the next order gonna be. Hopefully we get another 18, $20 order. You never know. All right, you guys, so we have a Panda Express order. Four items, 1.1 miles, $9.50. I'm right here by the mall slash restaurant drop off. Uh, we'll take this one. All right, you guys, like I said, let's head into this mall. Hopefully the order is ready by the time I get there and it's four plates, I noticed. So it's four large plates. Hopefully the order is ready by the time we head inside. All right, you guys, so just got a Chili's add-on for $10.50 for additional five miles. I'm here. You know what, we might take this Chili's order as well. You know what, we'll take it. All right, you guys, so I just picked up both orders, the large orders, the Chili's bag, and this is the order we picked up from Panda Express. The first customer is 0.3 miles away, and I'm assuming the second one is five miles from that. Anyways, let's go talk about these goodies. All right, you guys, so I dropped out those two orders. Everything went A-OK. -okay. Once again, that thing they call DoorDash. Four items, 1.8 miles, $10.25. I'm right here by the restaurant. Drop off the easy $10.75. Let's get it. All right, you guys, so we have our first order. Guess what, Grubhub decides to join the party. I believe $11.24. However, this restaurant is known for being slow. Hopefully, 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 the order is ready by the time we get there. Let's go get this paper. All right, you guys, look at this. The freaking DoorDash app decides to not work tonight, so. Look like you won't be using this for the dinner rush. 
we try, nothing happens, it stays there. I've been getting orders, I've been pausing it. However, I can't see the orders. The screen is all black, which is bizarre. Yeah, so it looks like we'll just be doing uh, good old Postmates, Uber Eats, and Grubhub for the dinner rush because good old DoorDash decides to act up. Anyways, let's get it. Alright you guys, so I dropped off that last order and that's the last order of the night. We're going to end the night a little early. Thanks to riding alone with your boy Zilla. Riding with Zilla. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Riding with Zilla. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Let's see if we get a goal of $100. Maybe even two. Let's see how much money we made today. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Made today. Hey, and as you know, we always round up on this channel, so on that thing they call Grubhub, $28.99, $29 Grubhub, and we had one order, Uber Eats, $7.48, we gonna round that up, $8 Uber Eats, and our main, main, main money maker of the day, that thing they call DoorDash, $109.78, so $110. Dollars on DoorDash for a grand total $147. We hit our goal for the day. Hey, hey, we hit our goal for the day. Hey, hey, $147. That's what your boy talking about. Hopefully, you enjoyed the ride along. I enjoyed your company. And as always, make sure you like, subscribe, share, comment. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.